Serving families has always been at the heart of the Williams Family YMCA, and we love that they now have a new place to play. The Tom Matovina Memorial Playground opened in December. Tom was known for his big heart and made many friends at the Y. The Flagler Center YMCA is proud to build new and diverse friendships throughout the communities we serve. Harry, a former boxing coach from Connecticut and a new member of the Flagler Y, had just lost his granddaughter to an illness and wanted to focus on improving his health and his social life. He never thought, however, he would meet Nick, a younger version of himself. I look at him as an awesome uncle, really. <laughs> It's like I literally look at it, I was like, he's, uh, we, he we wanted to say grandpa, but he said uncle. Oh, I didn't want to that. say it. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I say I'm about myself now, you know, I'd be trying to find something to do. I, I miss this, I miss this. Having this a blessing, the YNCA have just granted me with, you know what I'm saying, peace of heaven. Harry and Nick train twice a week and are determined to push themselves and each other to stay active and train towards their shared goals and passion. The Pana Vidro YMCA is developing future leaders. Students serve on the PVY's Teen Leadership Board and actively fundraise while also learning important skills for professional development. Members and volunteers at the Bank of America YMCA embrace the impact the Y has on community. Over 1,200 children enjoyed a brighter Christmas morning thanks to 700 donors in BOA's Angel Tree Collection Drive. Yeah.